nine iron versus pitching wedge? That is the question. Now a nine iron and a pitching wedge are only separated by about four degrees. The pitching wedge probably 48 or 46 degrees, sometimes down to 44 degrees. And the nine iron will be four degrees less than that in most sets. Sometimes you might find five degree difference or three degree difference, but generally standard is four degrees. You can use both for the same kind of chip. You can just let it roll out, you know, you've got to practice it. But there's a lot less, there's a lot more, a uh, lot more room for error when you're hitting these clubs. That was a nine iron. This is a pitching wedge. This is where they're very handy around the greens because you can use these to bump it and let it roll up. If you're using a 60 degree or a 56 degree, the spin is very inconsistent as an amateur golfer. People like Mo can do it because they, they are pros. But for us, we just want to chip it and let it roll up like that. That's going to be your best bet. Now for chipping, I would highly recommend using the Pitching or 9-iron as your sole bump and run club. You can see that the Pitching Wedge was not perfect for this one because I have to fly too far, but the 9-iron was really nice to roll the ball up. You can adapt it to your style, but for long shots, it's four degrees of difference. So what does that translate to? In my swing speed, that translates to 10 to 12 degrees between clubs. Mo, how much between your 9 and your Pitching Wedge? What's the difference? Yeah, 12. 12 yards. So Mo's also about 12 yards. We have, we, you know, not exactly similar swing speeds, but we can get it up there. At slower swing speeds, it may go down to 10, down to nine yards difference. For faster swing speeds, it may even go up to 13, 14, 15 degrees. That's why you'll see this range of clubs, people will start to adapt the, the angle of loft so that they can get a better spread. Another place you can use these both because it's only four degrees difference is on long bunker shots anything like 50 yards 45 yards 60 yards you just open the face up like a normal bunker shot but because there's so much less loft in here and the bounce is different it's going to get you a longer shot it will move left to right when you do that so aim a little left open it right up and just hit a long bunker shot other than that nine and pitching wedge not much difference besides 12 12 yards on long shots and chipping a different landing spot but both very versatile clubs for short game and for pitching and full shots into the green.